A unique event coming to San Francisco where some of the city's most gifted black chefs, musicians and artists will be sharing their talents. It's called Black Her and here to tell us all about it is event founder Melina Jones. Welcome to Bay Area Focus. Good to see you. Hi, wonderful to see you. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. So at the core of this event, we have art, food, wine and music, but it's deeper than that for you, right? Much deeper. Yes, indeed. Yeah. So, um, you know, my grandparents moved here uh, from Texas, like a lot of us did, um, folks from the black diaspora from the South. And uh, that was, you know, in the 50s. And my grandmother was widowed um, and was diabolically manipulated by her attorney to sign papers over to uh, him so that he could take care of her arrangements. And um, those papers were actually um, basically used to release all the property to him and she lost everything overnight. So that's, that's one thing. And then the other, um, the other thing that's really important to my heart is the people of San Francisco and the collective consciousness that actually makes up this incredible cosmopolitan city and the culture. So. Yeah, let's go back to the beginning. The event was born from your brand that you developed back in 2011 called Cur 415 and you call the brand your love letter to San Francisco. Why was that letter necessary for you? I just began to see so much displacement and particularly a call out for me was that, you know, there were folks who have lived in San Francisco for generations, um, who have a stake in San Francisco as natives. And when I started hearing more and more feedback and more responses that these folks did not feel like they belonged in their own city, it just really started to break my heart. So I'm a native born San Franciscan um, and, uh, you know, raised here between San Francisco and the rest of the Bay. And so, you know, we really, really have a distinct, beautiful spirit here. Um, so kind of going back to where things were a little bit more simple, we knew each other on a first name basis. Um, you know, we have a multitude of different genres kind of mixing and collaborating and this just melting pot started to really dissipate and I started to see it taper off. And I, instead of complaining about it, I decided that I wanted to try and do something about it to try and heal um, the heart of San Francisco. And now you've grown to a retail space at Westfield San Francisco <laughs> Center. And you just mentioned your grandparents as well. You've dedicated that space to your grandparents. I have, I have indeed. Uh, Westfield has been an enormous sponsor um, and just a supporter they have completely immersed me in nothing but love and resources. And, you know, it's a premier destination for retail. And, uh, you know, and now bringing in Car 415 is, is hopefully, you know, we can be a, a, you know, a little space that's a premier destination, destination for culture. And your goal now is to bring some joy to the area for summer and Juneteenth with an inaugural summer series. Tell us more about Black Kerr and what you hope will be a draw for people out there. So black cur, uh, first of all, the word cur is the French word for heart. So that's really significant. And because San Francisco, our unofficial mascot is the heart, like, you know, Tony Bennett, I left my heart in San Francisco. And then we have those beautiful heart sculptures that um, are all over, you know, downtown and Union Square. So we really have a tie to the actual heart. So cur is that French word uh, for heart. And um, it's really fitting because San Francisco is considered the Paris of the West, and we've had that nickname for a long time. 50% of the black population has basically had a mass exodus from the city, um, and that's pretty staggering since the 50s. So it really is a, a matter of now Black Her, with the, the heart of Black Her is assembling all of this rich talent that is left here and bringing all of that talent to a space downtown under the historic dome at Westfield, um, and then you know, offering and sharing this rich culture and sharing this cachet with the rest of the world. The problem is that we have a number of black businesses that are left here and really trying to thrive here and we're fragmented. And so it's important for all of us to be able to assemble and share our culture in one snapshot. So that's the, the kind of the core of Black Her. So, and, and the real essence of it is to preserve, amplify, and advance the culture of San Francisco, beginning with the Black diaspora. 
and you want to exclusively feature local black talent. That's correct. So we'll have local talent that we're going to be officially announcing the entire lineup next week. I believe that's the uh, week of the 13th. But yeah, so we're going to be featuring visual artists. Um, we're going to be featuring um, also, you know, chefs, uh, vintners, and um, just all genres of, of art basically with um, throughout the series. But this first one will be the visual art feature. And um, we're also going to be having an innovation reception that is woven into the, the art opening reception. So that is going to be particularly distinctive and very, very unique. It's not going to be this typical tech mixer. It's going to uh, involve like expression and other ways that we can look to see how we can innovate, um, particularly in the tech industry, because I am a designer. And I'm also a lyricist from San Francisco. And it's really important for me to bring technology and innovation, everything I learned in the tech industry as a designer uh, back to the black community and the, just the community at large. So everybody who makes up this amazing city. All right, cannot wait to see it all play out. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much for having me. And Black Car kicks off Juneteenth weekend on June 18th at the Westfield San Francisco Center. For tickets and information, visit kerr415.com slash blackcurr.